Hello everyone, in today's video I'm going to show you how to fix your Logitech G933 headset that keeps losing connectivity. Stay tuned. Ok, so to fix your headset, first you need to uninstall the Logitech gaming software and the headset drivers. I recommend using iobit uninstaller since it can remove all the registry edits and leftovers of the software. I'll provide a link for it in the description below. Open up iobit uninstaller and search for Logitech gaming software. Click on the recycle bin icon which means uninstall and select uninstall. I will fast forward the uninstalling process and will be back after it's done. Ok so click finish and now perform a powerful scan. This will look for all the registry edits. Select all of them and click delete. Close iobit uninstaller. Ok so now go to start menu and search for device manager. Open up device manager. And under the view tab select show hidden devices. Go to sound video and game controllers. And find logitech g933 gaming windows headset. Right click and uninstall it. Now head over to Logitech support page to download the latest software and select your operating system. Once the installation is complete, it's gonna ask you to restart your computer. Select please restart my computer now and click done. I'll be back when my windows boot up again. After installing the software and restarting your PC, installing the drivers again, we're gonna have to do a hardware reset. Okay, so uh, in order to do the hardware reset, you're gonna need a uh, Power clip or a tiny screwdriver for the switch because it's a small switch, and you have to plug in the headset with the USB power cable. You see that it lights up under the logo. It means that it's charging. Remove the left side panel, and uh, you need to stick the power clip inside the small hole next to the light and hold it there for two seconds. After that, remove it and hold it again for 2 seconds. Now close the panel and we'll go back to the Logitech Gaming Software to update the framework. Open up the Logitech Gaming Software and go to your headset tab. The newest version will force you to update the framework before using the headset, but if you installed an older one, I will show you how to manually update the framework. Okay, so to update the framework manually, you have to connect your headset with the power USB cable. And go to start menu, search for CMD, right click and run as administrator. Type in CD, which means change directory, forward slash and enter. This will take you back to your system drive. Now type in these commands and I will leave the commands in the description so don't worry about them. cd space program files forward slash logitech gaming software forward slash fw update forward slash g933. It 
will take you to the framework update folder and your headset. Now you can type dir to show the files inside your g933 folder. My updater version is 27. You might have updater 25 or older. So type in g933 update underscore version and your version here mine is 27 so i'll type 27.exe space and forward slash force press enter and it will take you to the framework updater it will start update once it's done you will have to go to the logitech gaming software head over to your headset and go to customize audio experience We'll find down here that there's if there is no audio, turn off your headset after. Default will be 5 minutes. Change it to never so your headset never turns off. I hope this video helped you. If it did, please leave a like and subscribe if you want more videos. I will see you again in the next video. Thanks for watching.